Hey guys, welcome to another Almost Inevitable uh, tutorial. And this time, what we're going to learn is how to add a mega menu to Divi. Uh, in order to do this, what you need to, of course, is to start with um, a Divi child theme. Okay, you always need a Divi child theme. So because we're going to add some uh, PHP code but you don't have to worry about it if you use a child theme. All right, so that, that'll take care of it. So just download this, install this, and activate it. And it should look something like uh, this. Install the child theme, and that's what you have. It'll live next to Divi, and it'll uh, piggyback on Divi. Of course, it's, the files won't look exactly the same because I'm, I keep using this for my tutorials. So it's got a lot of weird files here. Anyways. So uh, once you have this file inside functions, once you have the child theme inside functions, you'll be seeing uh, this part. There you go, this part. You'll be seeing this. It'll say uh, adding new uh, layout, uh, short codes for layouts and stuff, okay? Now, once you have that done, the rest is just really easy to set up. And you'll be surprised at how easy it is. Uh, First, you gotta start with the layout. Okay, the layout for um, the, the, the mega menu. I have currently made a layout here. Now what you can do is you can add new, uh, select layout and add a full-fledged layout or you can just um, go with a section if it's not that big of a, a mega menu, but uh, I just made a layout as you can see here, okay? Um, I will show you what I did. Of course, you can do anything in this. You can add rows, you can um, add contact forms, uh, short codes, whatever you want. Just make this into a, a, a layout, all right? Now, I've added this photo. This is probably from a previous uh, tutorial that I had. It doesn't really matter. It's just, it really doesn't matter. Okay, now, once this is done, what you will have is on this page, you will see, here we go, a short code. Okay, now copy that, Command C, and we're gonna go add a new plugin. Now this is, um, this is what makes everything so easy because what we're doing is we're packaging that layout into a short code. And we're gonna add that short code in menu in the plugins and you will find this little cute this guy, this cute thing, this guy. All right, so short code in menus. You're gonna install that right now. And once it's installed, you will wait for it to, okay. You will activate it. Uh, done, done, okay? So I'll go to menus because we are gonna make um, a mega menu, right? So here we go. This is a menu, and as you can see, I put in a lot of thought into these menu items. Um, on the top of the screen, you'll see screen options. Open up the CSS classes, and we're gonna add a custom link. That's gonna be nothing, and link test text is gonna be whatever you want. Menu, mega, mean I don't know there we go let's do that all right now open that up and type in mega menu now the reason why this works is because Divi actually has a CSS class that uh, is mega menu uh, I'll add a link but here is um, a really old not, not too old right not not too old but an old uh, but a a blog post on Elegant Themes website about the mega menu, and here it actually explains that you're gonna you're gonna be adding um, the CSS class mega menu, and that's what we use. All right, we use that to get the panel, the mega menu panel. All right, so that it goes here. That's it. Now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna actually because we added that plugin, you get this, which is cool. Now, if you don't see this. Go up here and you'll see in the boxes, you might be missing that, so just click that, open, uh, but it'll it'll probably show, okay? So um, 
you don't need the title unless you want a title. Uh, you're gonna drop that short code in there, add that to menu, pull that in here under as a oops, oh, as a sub menu of mega menu mean, and save that like this, and you're done. You go to the website, and under mega menu mean, you will get ta da a mega menu. That's it. You can actually add whatever you want. You can add layouts. You can do all, all the things you want. You can actually style this if you wanted to. A really nice way of, a really easy way of styling this is to actually go to, I can, I can give you some tips on how to style this, like if you wanted to, but yeah, um, here, the easiest way to be able to style this is like how you style, um, regular layouts and of course you can just do this mega menu now mega menu panel yeah something like this don't don't use mega menu because then it'll be um, the same CSS class as the the as this guy so it'll could, could cause problems okay so just do that something else like that and save that and you can just style away it'll be pretty easy to style after that so there you go everything's done and um, I think that's it pretty good pretty easy right so just uh, get that uh, plugin installed and then add mega menu to the CSS class here and uh, add that short code in here and you are done okay in here. All right. So, uh, have a great day and, uh, I will see you in another video. All right. Bye-bye.